we're here at the Open Power Summit, our second summit in San Jose, California. So we're really excited to get the show started. Uh, we've got about 20 different booths here today and we've got close to 80 different talks happening on the different solutions and advances and momentum of the Open Power Foundation. Open Power is all about innovation. What we keep seeing when we bring all of these companies together are solutions that could never be done by one company alone. And we saw a whole bunch of announcements this morning from Google and Rackspace. I'm thrilled to announce today with Rackspace, we're co-developing a Power9 server platform. We will make that server design available to the Open Compute project. It's fantastic to see the power of all these engineering teams working together. Finding relationships between yeah. disparate pieces of data that can be used across everything from marketing to retail. And then you've got Silicon Scapes that's, that's doing work where you can walk up the aisle of a grocery store and have assistance in finding products. So we're trying to help someone who's visually impaired. We stream the video uh, live to our Power 8 box that has a Xilinx FPGA um, inside of it. And so this demo just shows you the classification aspects of that system where we're panning this video and in real time uh, we're doing the recognition. So on our screen we have like a hypothetical marketing campaign where we're fusing together Twitter data in the billions, uh, weather data combined with critical infrastructure for a retailer. Here I have approximately 3.7 billion tweets and I can click live and this is what people are tweeting right now. You don't have to have any pre-canned queries of this makes sense with this other thing. You can just have a kernel of an idea and just explore that right then and there, you know, sitting in your seat. And this is just basically just a front end that you can craft to, of any style. We are the home of Redis. Redis is an open source technology. It's the fastest database on the planet. That's our claim to fame. Now, Redis Labs is the enterprise version of Redis, so that customers could run incredibly large databases. For example, a 40 terabyte database. That customer was renting over 100 servers on AWS. You can do that on only six IBM servers with a CAPI flash array. We're kind of in a valley right now when it comes to getting more performance out of our systems, and our demands are going up. Trying to figure out how to get around it without something like open power, it feels a lot like this. If you want to see everything that's happened at the summit, and if you haven't been able to join us here, come to our website. Follow us online, we've got a lot more to come.